right, so this is a video update of my current collection shelf. Um, it's very much still under construction, so you have to forgive all that. Um, my room's a wreck, all that, blah, blah, blah. Let's go. My only Titan. This right here, I got for $5 off of Amazon. It's on a clearance. It's a little washed out. It's probably not as fine a detail as the $60 one, but it was 5 bucks, and it looks pretty cool behind them, I think. It does a great job covering a lot of background. And this right here is cell phone box, spice racks, another cell phone box, another spice rack, another spice rack. And down here, um, forgive my PA over there, this is um, a bridge that I made out of cardboard and little greebly pieces and uh, wrapping paper rolls. And this is what I was talking about getting congested looking, this top shelf here and the little prime section over there with the other guys mixed in. It looks a little busy do something about that and I do have a bunch of guys standing straight but you know I try and at least have them not totally straight back you know I mean just have some kind of expression oh uh, impactor there sorry guy and then this here is another spice rack it's three tiers and it's kind of adjustable size so we're doing that and then sticking the leaders over here close to where the commanders are that are sitting flat on the ground. I think that looks pretty good. And then this bottom shelf under here I've got the one under construction making a, uh, I don't know, I think I'm going to have like a senatorial meeting area and obviously you know whose throne room this is going to be. Those are Pringles cans. Um, these are the Joy Toy Mecha Depots. Basically, those are just really cool kind of weathered Legos. So that's what I built. And then, then there's a little sniper roost with, a, I think it's a Cascade or whatever the other one's name is. This is actually the roof to Shockwave's lab. It's still under construction. i got to make walls. And i got to put the flooring down in the background on the walls. But all this stuff's modular. I can just pick it up and move it when I need to. So, And these are the DIY storage cubes. I've got a whole crap ton of those things. And I haven't figured out anything else to do with them. They might be the backgrounds. But what I've done is printed off sticker sheets. I think those look better over here. Yeah. I printed off sticker sheets and stuck those on there for decoration. And I've done that in a lot of areas. Everything's pretty much printed off my printer. These are actually like uh, role-playing tabletop game printouts. And uh, as long as I'm not trying to make a profit off this stuff, you know, I'm pretty fine using it. Um, people have offered to buy this stuff from me, and I can't really sell it because those aren't originally my designs. And, you know, I don't want to go down that rabbit hole, you know, costing the creator money. So, yeah, there's my collection so far. You know, um, it's not got space for everything. Uh, still got Beast Wars and live action off in crates. But for the most part, you know, this will hold everything but Beast Wars and live action. And I have a different idea for those two. All right, take care. I hope this gives somebody some inspiration on how to display their collection.